All right, so today we have a clip here of Ben Shapiro uh, talking about how he doesn't like how Harry Styles looks. Okay, other things that I hate today. So Harry Styles is a human. I, I've been informed that Harry Styles is a human. Now, I, I will, I, I've said before that I, I find Harry Styles pretty derivative. I mean, he's basically just doing David Bowie, but trans stuff. He's, Harry Styles is pretty much just doing doing David Bowie, but transed up. Uh, I don't, you know, that was a lot of word salad. Uh, when he says doing David Bowie, uh, you know, David Bowie was very flamboyant. He definitely knew how to fucking rock the shit out of any, any, he, he wore some really wild, really fucking funky ass, nice shit costumes and stuff that he would go out in. Um, but what is, what is Harry Styles doing David Bowie but transed up mean? Where's the trans part? Harry Styles isn't trans. There's That's not a part of it. You're just saying that because you don't like what he's doing, but that's not... that's Ben, facts don't care about your feelings, right? He's not trans. You can't say he's trans when he's not. Fucking idiot. Ben Shapiro, facts don't care about your feelings. He, he, he is supposed to be a fashion hero because he keeps wearing women's clothes on the cover of magazines. Because he's, he's flaunting the rules, guys. Ooh. And he's, it's all part of the face tattoo syndrome. Harry Styles. Well, well, the face tattoo syndrome. Oh, it's groundbreaking. He's wearing a dress on the cover of a man. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And then you say, well, yeah. Can we talk about how stupid it is that we even have uh, what you would call gender norms for clothing? Why is he upset about this? This doesn't fucking matter at all. If dude wants to wear a dress, dude can wear a dress. Why do you care, you fucking weirdo? What a creep. Why is he being so weird about it? Why, why does it matter? Is it because you tried to rock a dress and you didn't think you could and you weren't confident enough and so you're jealous of Harry because he can pull it off? Fuck, man. Just come out and say it. Just say, you know, it's, it's a struggle for you, Ben. It's okay. We will accept you. I will, at least. I love everybody. And that's not very masculine. He looks like he looks like a dope. Looks it's not. It's not very masculine. Oh, okay. It's the masculinity that Ben Shapiro has has a has a problem with. Ben, worry about your own masculinity. Figure out how to fucking uh. Ha fig can you figure out how to satisfy your wife before you talk about uh masculinity? Okay. This is so dumb. I mean, is this guy's a clown. He went to fucking clown school, clown college. This is a joke. This He belong in a fucking circus. What the fuck is he talking about? Masculinity. You guys want to see uh, Ben Shapiro masculinity? He just said that uh, Harry Styles looks like a dope. This is uh, Ben Shapiro, guys, for you. There's Ben Shapiro. He doesn't look like a dope, though. Totally normal looking guy. Totally normal looking guy. Yeah, he... Uh, yeah, that's um, it's normal. That's a normal way to um, to uh, look at this stuff, right? Uh, but here we'll go back to the clip. It's almost over. It's like an idiot, and maybe men should actually, you know, act masculine as a general rule. I, why? 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 Why do men have to act masculine? You, Ben Shapiro, you want to be masculine, and then you're trying to shove your stupid ideology down everyone else's throats. Isn't this what you say that the left does to you? Shove their ideology down your throat any chance they get? What is this men should be masculine as a general rule? What is this stupid bullshit? Why? Why? Why does that matter? I, 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 don't, I really don't understand this. There are people who are not, but maybe as like a model of male behavior, you might want to act like somewhat masculine. As a model of male behavior, you might want to act somewhat masculine. I personally, uh, you know, I don't think that there's anything uh, feminine about a man wearing a dress. It, a man wearing a dress can be a masculine thing. Ben Shapiro doesn't think that it can be. That's Ben Shapiro's own fault. That's his own way of thinking getting in the way of something that doesn't even matter in the first place. Okay? Um, I, and I mean, if Ben Shapiro wants to sit here and complain about Harry Styles, then he needs to complain about uh, all of the other people that wore dresses, uh, like fucking uh, Jared Leto. 
Uh, fucking uh, Dennis Rodman. He's not a great example. Fucking Prince. Prince would go out and wear fucking shit that wasn't considered masculine by our by our society. Fucking he already mentioned David Bowie, Mick Jagger, and the best example. This is an example that I I, I do want to use. Uh, the great rock band Nirvana. You guys, everyone knows Nirvana, Kurt Cobain. Uh, you know, they they wore dresses a bunch. They wore dresses all the time. And you listen to Nirvana's music. And I don't think Nirvana has a it's gender based or anything like that. So don't this is an example. But if you listen to Nirvana's music, you listen to Smells Like Teen Spirit or uh, you know, Something in the Way or whatever song you want to listen to, it doesn't sound it's not a it doesn't have a feminine sound. So if Ben Shapiro's going to complain about Harry Styles, he also needs to complain about Kurt Cobain, Lenny Kravitz, fucking Prince, fucking Mick Jagger, fucking so many other celebrities that are men that identify as men that I can name that also wear feminine clothes. Why is he not bitching at them? It's only Harry Styles. They have a problem with Harry specifically. It's kind of weird this obsession that he has with Harry, right? How dare you notice? Also, what makes you think he's not? Well, I, I think that it's not masculine to wear a dress. OK, well, you know, that's your fucking opinion and your opinion. Really, it's it's just a bad opinion. I mean, bro, come on. That's an opinion that's not based in any facts. That's not based on that's based on norms you accepted. That's based on societal norms that you said were OK and said, this is how I'm going to roll. Maybe people don't want to roll like that anymore, Ben. Figure it out. Come on. This is not hard. I, I mean, it's just going to put it out there. Doesn't seem like a particularly masculine thing to do. Why okay. does oh. it? He's Ben. Stop worrying about other men's masculinity and get yourself in check, Ben. Straighten the fuck up, Ben. Worrying about someone else's masculinity is probably one of the least masculine things I can think of personally. Why are you worried about other men's masculinity? You fucking dope. You weirdo. Why are you worried about other men being masculine? Are you attracted to him? Do you want him to be masculine for you? Like, what is this? This is insane. It's insane. Ben, whatever, whatever struggle you're going through, or whatever problem you're experiencing, whatever it is that you're insecure about, it's okay. We will still love you even though you're kind of a racist bigot and uh, kind of a piece of shit who lies a lot, but... Ben, just come out and just come clean. Get it off your chest. You'll feel better about it anyway. All right, um, that's going to be it for this video. If you guys like the video, then hit the like button. It helps me out so, so much. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see more content like this. And then press that little bell and turn on all notifications so you guys never miss an upload.